what up guys side five gaming of course uh jimmy light armor the slim jim <laughs> i don't remember who who called it that but props to them i love that title that's freaking hilarious but anyway got tons and tons of footage of this that i i just haven't gone through this is the most recent it's from uh we were i was playing just the other night having a horrid time in raiding matches you know i was i was like a quarter of the way of alpha and got knocked back down to like halfway down to a minus and I think this is a 300 cost match. I said, screw it. I'm going to bust out the light armor and just, you know, just try and shoot people and grenade people and then, and then go in when I have an opportunity, you know, with the melee. Uh, this suit, you know, in the beginning it was, it was kind of scary for noobs to use because of how fragile it is and whatnot. But once you lean into its weapon systems and you get used to the maneuver armor and just rushing down, you know, the yellows, uh, it, it works really, really well. I think it's, I think it's very dominant, you know, in its classifications. And it's cost levels so but it's you know i don't see too many of them up at, up at the it's higher costs but i know that i can do well in it so we just said screw it and we're going to try and dominate going off right there with the beam gun That little beam Uzi, the stripped down beam rifle is just, it's by far one of the best beam weapons in the game, if not, I mean, it, it's got to, it, it takes, I think, it, you know, aside from like the large ones, oh, boom, look at that, oh god, I love when I get those grenade throws, again, you know, it's just one of those lottery freaking grenade throws, the new type grenade throws, as I, as I like to, like to call them, absolutely love that. But anyway, this beam rifle is just sick. Just absolutely sick. The cyclic rate, the charge rate, you know, the recharge rate is just fantastic. <laughs> Good God. It's just me and the sniper customs just busted out that water pistol and he was just dumping on that dude at the same time I was. We had a decent lead. Look, they, well, they just got 500 right there, but we had them pretty much except down, still down at 50. I'm going to try and make a move for Delta. Get us some more ground. One of their Zaku's decides to come play with me over here. <laughs> Shoot him right in the top of the head. Well, and right when I get stunned, that goof comes in with the tendril. Good for him, yeah. Good goof up, pilot. Oh, but here comes the rain. And that's that. For life number one. Alright, see somebody's taking Charlie. Can't let that happen. Gotta get over there immediately. And it's yellow, just start dumping on him. I guess I guess I shot the pilot with the beam gun? <laughs> I couldn't even tell it, but either way, worked out. We'll take it, right? Awesome. Excuse me while I'm drinking beer and eating cookies while I'm filming this. The camo or the, the color scheme that I'm rocking is like my old Army Woodland, uh, you know, Army Green setup that I had made, anticipating like a, a woodland map at some point in time. I mean, just but there's not. It's just all desert stuff, you know, and then a couple, you know, a couple steel and concrete maps. But that's about it. But I decided to bust out and use it as I get caught way out of position there. I was just trying to put some more hurt on that weapons rack. Oh, before I just get decimated. That's what I get. Calling, crying for help. Nothing doing. Not gonna happen, but it's okay. I like to use the excuse that my TV's too big so I can't see my radar. <laughs> That's why I get caught out by, by the, the guys spawning around. Oh, as we drop somebody with the airstrike. 
Alright. We know who's up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Home dude's going vertical. I'm going to stay on the ground. Try to land in some nades. Yes. Now, this time, I see the goof. Don't care. Just got to get this yellow. There we go. All right, now we can deal with the goof. Well, they can deal with the goof. Thank you. We're going to survive that engagement. Just barely. Back to the old trusty beam gun. I love getting on top of the, the high buildings on this map. It's freaking awesome. Now I know I should have had my saber out here to just knock this guy out of the sky, but... Didn't do it that time. Done it plenty of times before and it's really funny. Ooh, yes. Get some. Absolutely love it right there. Right there is, as you can see, that was the maneuver armor actually working for me. I think I think I was maybe a, a half a second ahead of it. If I would have been a half a second behind and initiated my boost later than that, uh, he would have got me. But as you can see right there, that is a perfect example of using maneuver armor. And here comes that goof, man. He just wants it. You can get it. Decent lead now. Getting almost 5k. Oof. Explosion to the toe. <laughs> Looks like a super quick respawn with that edit. <laughs> it does not respawn that fast. Oh, how did that grenade not get him? Now we're just trying to clean up. Wait for him to charge. Yeah. Oh, he's still alive. Again, we see this all the time when they get left with one health, but we've got to collect that kill. Get him in the leg with the beam. And a little bit of seasoning on that goof to round out the score. Awesome match. Just really, really nice to, you know, get some get back for all those losses in rating doing well there what was it uh 2450 and the personal score 60 over 68,000 damage uh also got most diversion and we got six kills three deaths and a couple of pursuit assists so that's gonna do it thanks for checking it out guys and we'll see you next time on sci-fi gaming bye bye